welcome back. Thanks for joining me again. Today we are going to be learning how to play Lightly Roam. I've got some sheet music for you on the website with the note names already written in. So there's a link in the description below. You can head on over and grab yourself a copy and I'll be here waiting when you get back. Okay, let's get started. Taking a look at our music, we noticed that um, I've written in my landmark notes. These are notes that help me to navigate in the music. Um, I like the G line to be red in the treble staff and the F line to be green in the bass staff. That gives me a quick way to identify what note I'm playing and how close the other notes are to that note. Our time signature today is 4-4. Four, four. So that's telling us there are four beats in each measure and quarter notes get one beat. We are playing on a grand staff, so the two lines are read simultaneously. Don't worry though, nothing to panic about yet. The left hand is still keeping its whole rests while the right hand plays for the first line. And then when we switch to the second line, the treble staff gets its chance to rest. That's the right hand and the bass staff takes over the melody. The treble staff are all of the notes above middle C on the right side of the piano. That's why it's our right hand. And the bass staff notes are all of the notes lower than middle C on the left side of the piano. And that's why we play with our left hand. Let's get into that rhythm. We are going to count to four and then be tapping right hand on the right leg for the treble staff notes and left hand on the left leg for the bass staff notes. One, two, three, four. 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 Fantastic, that's really nicely done. We're gonna do it again. This time, we'll watch the music scroll by on the screen. Um, so that you can see exactly what the music looks like um, and where we are in the music as we're tapping and counting. One, two, three, four. 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 Now it is time to play. So we'll place our hands on the piano, hold up your right hand and wiggle the second finger. We're looking to the middle of the piano to find two black keys and that is where we find our doorway. Second finger on that D key and then everybody else lines up. Looking in the music, we can see that our first note is G. It's on our landmark line and we are playing that with finger five. So that's right here with our pinky finger. And when the left hand comes in, we're also starting with G, but left hand plays G with the first finger. Holding up our left hand, we wiggle the fourth finger and we look for that group of tuba keys below the right hand. And then line everybody else up. There's D and here's finger one on the G key. Okay, we are ready to play. Counting to four, we'll sing our note names. One, two, three, four. G, E, E, F, D, D, C, D, E, F, G, 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 E, E, Thanks again for joining me. Don't forget
be sure to subscribe so that you can keep those lessons coming. You'll be playing like a pro in no time.